In this video, we're going to look at selection with more than two outcomes in Scratch. So far, we've used this block, which allows us to enter a condition and check if it's been met. If it has, something happens. If it hasn't, something else happens, giving us only two possible outcomes. But what happens if you want a program that has more than two possible outcomes? What can we do then? It's simple. In Scratch, we just use another one of these blocks and we place it inside the else. This gives us three possible outcomes. And we can keep adding as many of these blocks inside of the else to increase the amount of possible outcomes. All right, let's get carried away. Let's look at an example of a program in Scratch that uses more than two possible outcomes. Here's an example of a program in Scratch which has three possible outcomes. Create this program in Scratch and test it out. Pause the video here to give yourself time to do this. You can see here we ask the user for their age. Then the program will store their age in the age variable. After this, we check if they entered 11. If they did, the following message will be presented. If not, we then go to the next if statement, which is checking if they entered a number over 11. If this is the case, the following message is presented. Otherwise, it will present this message. And that's everything you need to know about selection in Scratch.